and happy World Food Day. My name is Tony Eber. This morning, I've come to talk to you about something that's important to me. The food security. Today is World Food Day. And it's important we reflect about the state of food in country, in Africa. I was discussing with some group of farmers yesterday, and they were complaining about the cost of food items that they produce, especially let me take cassava as an example. Some farmers are really crying that the cost of cassava is so low now in the farm, and they could not even sell their cassava. Yet, in the market, the people are complaining that the cost of food is too high. This is an irony. The farmers are complaining. It is too cheap. They cannot sell. The buyers are complaining. It is too expensive. We cannot buy. And this is causing kind of stress in the food security. And what is the problem? The problem is productivity. The cost of production is so high. The cost of chemical is so high. The cost of uh, labor is so, in fact, there is no labor, no more labor involved. And we don't even have the appropriate technology. These are the things we want government to look into. There must be a way of bringing the cost of food production down. One, by increasing the productivity. Two, by introducing technology and innovation. We cannot continue to be doing it the same way and we want food to be abound. These are the things we must look as we are celebrating food. Day. Let us think about how to make the cost of production down, increase our productivity, so that the farmer can produce at a profit and the buyer too can buy at a reasonable price that will make it reasonable for them so that we can have food security. Without productivity, without technology and innovation, food security will be challenged. Let us introduce technology productivity. Let us encourage the farmer to produce at a price they can make profit so that we can keep in business and a control can be sustainable. That's what I want to say about food technology, I mean food security. But for today, as a chief herbalist, this is an a herbal executive order. I want you to go and look for this vegetable today. This is a bolo leaf and eat it for the food. They use it to eat panadium. The first thing you have to do, boil the water and drink it. This will clean your system, clean your kidney, and then you need vegetable to make a very good vegetable sauce and use it for pandel yam and mala or eba. This is April vegetable. It's an executive harbor order. Get it by today, you must eat today. Go to the market, you find it there. Thank you. My name is Tony Eba, your chief harborist.